The sun is the original source of all the energy embodied on this planet. Whether we are burning oil, natural gas, propane, biofuels, or a pile of driftwood on a beach, energy from the sun created all of these resources. The sun is also the ultimate source for renewable energy. Its duration and intensity form utterly predictable patterns. In 2002, the total solar energy absorbed by Earth's atmosphere, oceans, and land masses in one hour was more than the entire world consumed in one year. This seemingly endless resource has only one major hindrance, the inefficiency of currently available photovoltaic systems. Solar panels have an average efficiency of 12%, with the world record for solar cell efficiency at 40.7%. The energy from the sun, which is not captured and converted into electricity, is converted into heat. A solution for this problem would be to create a system where solar cells are enclosed in glass or clear plastic, trapping that heat. Water, air, or an antifreeze-like solution is circulated past the PV cells, drawing the heat away from the cells, increasing their efficiency. This also helps remove the buildup of excess heat within the structure. The heat energy then is drawn away from the PV cells where it can be utilized to heat water or air or be transferred into what is known as a heat sink. This is a very dense mass which would trap the heat within its structure until a later time when it can be released for consumption. The heat sink could heat water or air later or convert the heat into electricity through kinetic energy. This can be achieved through the use of a Stirling engine. The Stirling engine captures the energy from rapidly expanding and contracting gases and requires only heat differential to operate. By rapidly expanding gases on one end of the cylinder, contracting them on the other side of the cylinder, and displacing the gas intermittently, a Stirling cycle occurs. Using the pressure from the rapidly expanding and contracting gases, kinetic energy is created repeatedly as each Stirling cycle completes. The kinetic energy can generate electricity on demand by turning a turbine or can be stored in a vacuum sealed maglev flywheel. The flywheel is a kinetic battery which spins at very high speed storing energy which is instantly available when needed. High speed flywheels are typically made from carbon fiber composite materials with higher tensile strength making them more able to withstand stresses associated with higher rotational speeds. Magnetic bearings are used to levitate the flywheels in a sealed vacuum, which virtually eliminates energy loss from friction. This system uses every component of the powerful solar energy we receive each day. The PV cells generate electricity directly, while the excess heat is drawn away, increasing their efficiency. The heat is used to meet any direct heating needs or stored away for later use. The use of the Stirling engine creates a 24-hour cycle of electricity production, by utilizing heat from the heat sink at night and residual energy from the day. The use of flywheels and heat sinks will help with the load balancing as well as store energy creating a permanently sustainable energy solution.